Welcome back, YouTube. It's episode 34 of the Elden Ring Fit series, and in today's episode, it gets a little bit dark, honestly. Um, boy, we find a really dark secret of, uh, about Saluvius, and, uh, I genuinely don't know how I feel about it. Um, I doubt he was a good sorcerer, but, uh, Boy, howdy, we found some stuff about him that, uh... You'll just have to watch and see, honestly, because I don't really know how to explain it, but, um... Yeah. Let's get into it, shall we? Alright, Nafali. Son of a bitch. Actually, is there anybody new here? Are you new? No, you're just a player, I mean. No, nobody new, alright. Alright. Um, I guess we could talk to you now, huh? Journey to the capital. The two fingers you may be. You just don't care about the thing? I mean, oh. Always talk to the dead. Ah, you've already heard. Indeed. It seemed the whelp harbored suspicions. So I had no further use for her. Honestly, what's a man to do? A determined Yikes. plebeian is more wicked than an omen horn. Quite frankly, I suspect that's just what the Queen wants. A dose of ambition to incite the tarnished. Yikes. Okay. So now, theoretically, when we talk to her, we might be able to bring that up, if nothing else. I don't know, man. I just want to fucking talk to her so I can give her the goddamn potion and go to Selvius and be like, listen, I finally tracked this bitch down. She's fucking elusive as hell, but I did it. Please don't be crouched. Son of a bitch. Oh, you. Please. It's pathetic, I know, but... Ah, no mind. We're good. I heard from Gideon. So you know already, do you? Maybe. It's true. Oh. My father cast me out for indulging my emotions. Forgetting the mission. Punishment for offing his pawns. Father, mother, Lord Gideon has offered me guidance all my life. I would have done anything for him to place him on the throne of Elden Lord. And yet I, though it was not my intent, I betrayed him. Listen, can you just drink this potion, please? And I can no longer trust him, Father, to think he'd order his men to enact such tragedy. Where is the justice he purports in that? He once told me that if he became Elden Lord, he would never allow the downtrodden to be cheated ever again. Was he simply lying to me? Yeah, probably. No, no, no. How could I say that? Father has always given me his guidance. And now... I've lost it. Here, let me be your guidance. Drink this fucking potion. Medicine, is it? Fine. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'll take a dose. Perhaps it'll do me some good. We did it, Salvius. It's very sweet, isn't it? I don't know. I never very, drank it. Very. I don't, I don't like the sound of that. Did we just... Did we just kill her? Nefali? Nefali? I don't know what that noise was. Nefali? Wake up. Nefali? Please. Well, shit. Oh, is she? Oh, yeah, she is swaying side to side. Maybe you just put her to sleep. Alright. Either way, quest complete. Let's go tell Selvius. 
I mean, to be fair, I probably should have suspected something like that would happen where it was Saluvius and Saluvius seems like a fucking absolute piece of shit. But he is a sorcerer and I want to learn cool spells from him. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> we didn't level up. It'll be fun. It'll be fine. I hope. Oh, Saluvius, you'll never believe what I did. I finally tracked down the folly. Are you proud of me? Ah, so you made Nefeli drink the potion. How'd you well know? Done. You are a touch more useful than I had thought. Very well. Then you shall have your gift. Tigers. Knowledge of the sorceress arts yes. and of the tutelage of the great preceptor Selavis. I doubt much of it will lay within the grasp of a mere tarnished, but if you put your mind to it, perhaps you won't embarrass our lady. It would never. You wish to begin right this moment? Yeah, fuck it, why not? Well, your impatience, though boorish, is understandable. Let's have at it. Yeah, please, please don't spoil it. Therian Felix forms a defensive arch with numerous magic healing planes. Okay. Therian Retaliation dispels enemy spells with and retaliates with healing planes. That's kind of cool. Fires massive cold magic from Glenstone. Releases cold mist before caster. Interesting. Sorcery said to have been used by the old snow witch. This is a cold mist before the caster. This sorcery can be cast while in motion, charging enhances range of the mist. The snowy crone thought taught the young Rani to fear the dark moon as she imparted her cold sorcery. The glintstone serves as a conduit, launching a mass of cold magic. This sorcery can be cast repeatedly and while in motion. The snowy crone taught the young Rani to fear the moon. Swing your staff to dispel incoming sorceries and incantations, using their powers to retaliate with glint blades. This was the Carrion royal family's secret means to prepare against the disloyalty of the academy. The moon and stars would one day go their separate ways. It's a defensive arch with numerous magic lens plays overhead, which automatically attack nearby foe. <laughs> I don't necessarily know if I want any of these. Right? Because they are, they are expensive. And we have enough for a level up right now, which I think is a little bit more important. Like, sure, if we had like 10k or so, maybe I would spend it on this. But like, because we have enough for a level up right now, I don't want to buy any of these. But I will make a notation on my book of notes for editing. Um, when I edit. And we'll probably come back to this. Begging for another lesson so soon. Sure. Uh, there remains much to be done. Make it quick. Oh, no, no man. Um. Huh. Huh. Well, alrighty then. He didn't give us anything, right? It was just, uh learning the spell why did i come up here <laughs> or the ability to learn spells i guess okay. all right so now that we've destroyed the earth should we go see if rani woke up right maybe we were we're pretty close Turn over to Ronnie. I think we can make it this way, right? Ooh. 
Heart golden runes. Oh wait, no, I don't think we can. I don't think so. All right. Is there anything over here? I don't think we ever ever explored. I just kind of like realized we never really explored. We kind of rushed through this place. Jesus Christ. I don't know if there would be anything. Uh, I am going to play it safe and hop off torrents and then face this way and hop back on. Some boids. Just curious. Ah, uh, they could have hidden item back here. Damn it. It's not like a hidden wall, right? Oh, all right. I didn't think so, but I figured they added that area, so maybe. Okay. I don't think there should be anything here either. All right. All right. Um. Is there anything with this? It's like shrouded in mist, so it's kind of hard to like see everything. But it is like a structure. Oh, I thought that was a fucking blood stain. I'm like, what the fuck killed you? Hmm. Hmm. Wait, was that something up there? No, it was a leaf. Never mind. Thank you. Anything with this structure? I thought I heard something. Merchant ahead. Oh. Just be like further down as well. Okay, there is a landing here. This seems perfectly safe. I guess we just fall down. Land on that to make sure we don't take fall damage. Okay. Oh, is this? Is this on top of the thing? Because we actually, now that I'm thinking about it, we never hit the, the, um, the loot that was up here. Never did hit the loot that was up here. 
Also, I realize now that if we had died and lost all those runes, um, <laughs> would have been really fucking bad. You can't do anything with those. Um, it said merchant, but I don't. Anybody? Oh. Okay. I am charged with maintaining these ghastly dolls. Ah, it's like dolls. Your worship, allow me to be of use. Other than the puppets, there are some very fine things up here in this storeroom. Why not pick something out before you go? But please. Can you offer poor ill-starred Pitya a little something by way of compensation? I mean, I do have runes. I don't know if that's what you're looking for. Cutting horn. I don't know if any of these are going to be good for us. Unless you'll do. Carry out absolution. Okay. A larval tear weathered map. Ripple blade. His affinities. All right. All right. Old bone arrow fledged. Okay. I mean, it seems like we should buy this. I don't necessarily know if we need this, but it is good that we know it's here. So, uh, editor, make sure to write that down. Okay, me, write it down. I think it was this one. To pick streaks of amber light. Hmm. I have no idea where the hell that is. Okay, and then you just go back to that. Hmm. All right. Is there a shortcut to unlock up? For something? I hope. We got a ladder that we can shove back down. I know that was a thing in Dark Souls, and I know it was a thing here because we did one. But it doesn't look like there is, unfortunately. We're gonna go here though and level up before I lose some runes. Level up our health to 30. Now we're almost at a thousand health. Which actually we probably are over a thousand health with our um with our equipment. Hold up. So that being said. Oh wait, no, we, we actually wanna go back to the mausoleum because we want to see now if we can use that mausoleum for anything hopefully we don't need to knock it back down oh, okay good I almost had it. I'm gonna be really upset if Orange was wrong. Because we should be able to just duplicate it. So it must not be this one. You know what? Fuck it. We're here. Let's go uh, try to fuck up the Erd tree. Dude. 
There are night comet. All right. All right. Torrent bud. Thank you. Oh, big dude's like right behind that pot. Oh, shit. The fuck, we're up against a rock. Oh, you're doing that one, huh? Oh, you're doing it again, huh? That's cool. Yep. All right, let's do this. Or not. That's cool. Damn it. That being said, we we do seem to be doing a lot more damage now. Oh, is that just a? Is there? Oh no, never mind. That's... Those are our runes. I thought that was a sight of grace. Oh, how are we on that? Oopsie. Shit, I just unequip. <sighs> ah, fuck, I'm unequipping everything. There we go. Listen, I know you just unequipped, but if you could just cast twice real quick. Thank you. Ah! Enemy failed. Magic shrouding. Ooh, I jump for joy. Lightning shrouding and holy shrouded. Uh, boost lightning attack. Boost magic attacks. Holy. We do that and that. Then we actually have a good flask to have. Yeah. That seems like a great idea. We got Night Comet. We're on Cerulean, which is still on two. But that should be a okay. Damn it. Ooh, okay. He still one shots us? Actually, yeah, no, I'm I'm just going to die here because we don't have enough Cerulean tears to kill him, I just noticed. Um Luckily, our rune should be further away, so we're just gonna grab him and skedaddle to the other Erd tree that's in Kaelid. Now, there are dudes who ambush us. So we're gonna run past them and get to the other side of the tree. Should be one dude to the left. And some to the right. But if we just go this way... Yikes. Okay, he doesn't one-shot us, which is fantastic news. Hopefully, he um, takes a lot of damage from us, though. Is that a door? Wait, hold on. That's a door right there. Yeah, you back up. Some catacombs, huh? Interesting. Okay, well, I think we just discovered 
what we might end up doing for the rest of the stream is good because I know what we're doing next week um, which is just going down below where the star apparently hit uh, we might not have enough mana Thanks. Right, he's backing up. He's a little scaredy baby. Oh, never mind. We have two. We should be fine to kill this dude. Why are you still running, man? I have to sneeze. We did it. I sneezed. Boo -doo -doo -doo. What did we get? Green burst. Jump for joy. Flame shrouding. So that probably increases flame. Yum. Yeah. Stamina recovery speed. Okay. Not horrible. Still got some magic ones out. So. Uh, there's that That being said before we dive into this dungeon I Apparently we're gonna have a panic attack on this campfire <laughs> We should actually probably swap back our flask usage As we have another panic attack <laughs> Back to 4-4 four, four. nice even split Could potentially just do like 5-3 because we do have the backup flask but Be wary of up. So it would seem. Uh, 400, that might just be night shard. Okay. Yay. Okay. Um, let's go this way. I'm gonna send it back up though. Try fire. What do you mean? Oh, there's a person over there. Close enough. You what the fuck? Okay. Okay, Night Comet. Night Comet does wonders. I always crimson fuck. I didn't notice in time. Glass shards. Are we gonna have that? Oh, is this Scarlet Rot bullshit? Oh, whoops. God, I hope not. If so, we're just running across. That is Scarlet Rot. Maybe it is. I don't know. Either way, hopefully we don't find that. Yikes. Well, fiddlesticks. The thing that we're supposed to do here.
Because it doesn't necessarily seem like it. I think we're just gonna go. I don't think we can hit them. Maybe if they get a little tiny bit closer. Nice. Uh, we can't do another one though. We are running out of cerulean now. Should have stopped moving behind that pillar, dog. Okay. So now we don't fall into the hole. And if we go this way, we should most likely just lead back up to where we were just fighting people. I don't see anything up. Can you target him, please? Let me go back to the night shard. You know, I was just thinking to myself, we should probably heal, huh? How were all of those missing? What the fuck was that, man? Okay, so now, real quickly, we go boom, boom. It does that, it boosts our stuff as well. They probably should have healed first. There not another dude? Okay, I guess there wasn't. Should have been looking up, honestly. A lever. Maybe do her somewhere over on this side. Uh, ro roll, please. Door anywhere to be honest. Uh -oh. Come on, you can see him. It should be fine. Okay. Good. Covered in blood again. Oh, not more of you fuckers. Shit. The. Uh... And then a last cerulean, which isn't green. Just stick with night shard. I'm just go haul ass.
Okay, maybe this was the door. Uh, back to Night Comet. There's going to be more in here. There always is. Fuck. That's actually really, really bad for us. So it was Scarlet Rod. These are just crabs. Golden Rune Tier 4, not bad. Aha. Uh -huh. Be in comment. Die. There wasn't one behind us. One there, though. We might end up running out of mana. We got a single night shard left. Fuck. All right. Time to pull out the heavy guns. And see what it do. Unless there's just nobody. Imp head wolf, you know, for when we got that dog. Head covering made from the largely unaltered head of an impish golem resembling a wolf. It holds trace amount of looping endurance. Okay, so it gives us two endurance. Oh boy. How cool is that? Is that it? Let's just double check while we're right here. Fuck it. Nothing there. I mean, if anything, it's gonna be like down at the. Oh, yeah, we didn't go straight. Right? And this leads into the boss where we're gonna be forced to die. Because uh, we have literally nothing except for one night shard and a little bit of hope with this sword that we've never used <gasps> Wait a second It's not, it's not moving at all. Okay. Oh, we have to move though. All right, fuck it. Let's go die to boss, I guess. Cause I don't know what else we can do. Oh good, there's two of them. Boom, you're dead. Boom, I'm dead. Honestly, I'm glad because now we should be able to teleport back there and fuck them up with spells. Yikes. Never 
run crimson. Alright, can we do with that? Okay, can we do with that? It's fine. Oh my god, I just need to move. one last time cerulean fuck al big bonkers Ooh. Ooh. Mad pumpkin head. Ooh, I jumped for joy. Okay. It was uh cutting it a little, a little tiny bit close, honestly. But we did it. So that's good. Oh fuck, we're out of crimson. We're dead. You have a fucking sword? Oh, we got caught on shit then. Then we sneak. And battle roll away. I think we're okay. What the fuck? Not you fuckers again. God damn it. Who the fuck are you? Son of a bitch. Try right down. What the fuck do you mean try right down? Oh great, now you got the fucking dragon angry at us. Ronnie, save me, please. <laughs> I forgot there's fucking wolves that run too. Hey, no, we're chill, we're chill, we're chill. We're friends. We're doggos. Okay, that should reset all aggro. Why the fuck did it say try down? I want to head back there though. No, I do not want to target them. Are hey, you ready, son of a bitch? Die. Rune fragment and Roa Frids. Oh? Or was it a secret? Why did I roll that second time? I was starting to think that nothing was going on. Huh. Interesting. Looks like more of the uh, lifeless puppets um, that that one dude was saying. Uh, incantation. Oh, there's an incantation. Well, I guess we don't really fuck around with incantations at all. Your message. Saluvius puppet? 
Wait, did they? Did they really add a fucking let me solo her Easter egg? Holy shit, that's fucking awesome. That's so fucking cool. That's so fucking awesome that they did that. Holy shit. The man, the myth, the legend. Okay, interesting. You just say attacking ahead. You mean like here? I guess so. Who's over here though? Anything? Bunch of people. Hmm. Is that selling? Wait. Why is selling here? Is that? Oh, fuck. That's Nefali. What the fuck is going on? Is that why Saluvis knew? What the fuck? Hey, I am genuinely fucking creeped out. So because we gave the introduction to Selen, is Selen still alive? Didn't we just go to Selen? We gotta check on Selen. But I also like we also gotta fucking go over to Saluvis and be like, dog, what the fuck did we just give Nefali? Cause that's fucked up. That shit straight up fucked. Alright, Saluvis, you got some fucking explaining to do, dog. Dragon or not, we're heading straight fucking there. Because you killed Nefali. Or you made us, I guess, kill Nefali. Or some shit, I don't fucking know. But you guys should explain in the do. That's for sure. And then in the dragon knot. Please, thank you. Begging the fuck, Salubis? So no, I'm begging for a <laughs> fucking explanation. So it is his you chambers. Into a man's private chambers, rooting about as you please. Is it a boat? Officiousness knows no bounds. Fine and well, you tricked Nefeli and had her drink the potion. Didn't necessarily you trick. My accomplice. Ah, you fuck. For a puppet of your own. What do you mean a well, puppet? Normally, one of your stature would never be allowed, but perhaps I can make a very special exception. Now, choose. What do you mean choose? What? Summon spirit finger maiden Theranlinda? Who the fuck is that? Summons jaw Jar right Jaw writ spirit? Okay, let me solo her. Uh Dolores the Sleeping Arrow. I don't know who the fuck any of these people are really. One of Saluvius's favorite puppets who used to summon the spirit of Dolores the Sleeping Arrow, spirit of a handsome archer who dressed in the style of a man, called the Silent Hunter by some, she fires Saint Trina's arrows from her short bow. Dolores once belonged to the Round Table Hold, where she was both a critic and a friend of Gideon the All-Knowing. It was because of her that he and Saluvius went their separate ways. 
Summon the spirit of a jar writ. Spirit of a man who wished to become the innards of a living jar. A jar jar curling specialist who throws all manner of pots and jars. The warrior jar once named told the nameless man this. You are not yet ready to join the warriors inside. No, you must apply yourself, better yourself, and one day I return for you. Okay, so it's not... I guess it wasn't actually let me solo her but it is like the outfit that let me solo her goes for interesting spirit of the finger maiden who never met the tarnish she was meant to guide she uses healing incantation and holy water pots but she is not a fighter by nature and is ill suited to bat sweet suited to battle i don't know why i fucked that up a maiden without a tarnished, a tarnished without a maiden, and yet no guide to bring them together. Hmm. I mean, this seems like it would be healing more than attacking. This does have way more of an FP cost, but also sounds kind of more badass. Healing incantation. I mean, if it can just be heals for us, it wouldn't necessarily be the worst, right? Yeah, fuck it. Okay. So, like, now we could buy some of these, and maybe we should. Since we are really far away from a level up uh we can't get both and i don't think we're necessarily gonna do that so we'll just buy this i don't even think we'll use that either but still all right so you know we're talking for another lesson so soon Ugh, there remains much to be done make it quick that's that's it that's all you're going to talk about That's, that's it. You better hope Ronnie is still sleeping. I'm going to be honest. You best fucking hope that Ronnie's still sleeping right now. Because that's right where we're fucking going right now. To see if she knows about the fucking creep you are. Ah, she's still sleepy. Fuck. Okay. There you are, my apprentice. Yeah, we saw. Uh, anyways, uh, not necessarily a lesson. Maybe she doesn't know. Yikes. Yikes. That's a. That's a yikes moment. Man, so we essentially just turned the folly into a puppet. That's cool, I guess. Um, found a creepy fucking stash of puppets. That is apparently Saluvis's quarters. But we're also technically an accomplice because we gave Nefali the potion that we didn't know what it did. So that sucks. Um, and he gave us a. Sp Spirit summon of our own, which he called the puppet, which also kind of sucks because <laughs> that further implicates us, I guess. I think we're just beginning blackmailed by Saluvis at this point. Fuck. With that being said, if you're on the YouTubes, you can always like and subscribe if you so desire. You can even head on over to the stream because every Sunday, right around noon Eastern, I stream this live and then I chop it up into nice little segments which uh, go up on YouTube every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. So you can also stay on YouTube if you want, but you do miss out on uh, four to five hours worth of content because obviously when I chop it up, it's not four to five hours. It's more like, what, an hour and a half to two hours total because uh, I try to make it 
around 45 minutes or so um give or take sometimes it's longer sometimes it's shorter it all depends on uh the flow of everything i suppose but with that being said i do hope you all enjoy and um next time we will uh figure out what happened with the comet or star that hit the ground somewhere in the mistwoods that's the goal for next week so with that being said i'll see you all next time okay bye